Hi, in this short video I'm going to introduce some new functionality that we've released within GOS RCM version 9.1.0.1. It allows website visitors to pick a location within a map on a form and submit it to GOS RCM where the data is captured and can be further interrogated. So I'm on a page here inviting people to publish, publicise their event. So I've got quite a simple form. I can give it a, the event a name. Let's call it a circus. It's showing the default location that I've specified. I can type a new location in. Let's say Hyde Park. Click on search. Hyde Park's quite a big area. I can grab the pin and pop it where I want. Let's have it there. And then there's all the normal map features. I can zoom, move the map around, change it to a satellite view, and even drag the street view on. And look around. This will help me. There's my pin next to the Albert Memorial, and I'll put my circus there. So once I've uh, got my data that I want to submit, I can click Submit Event. And this data has now been sent to GOSS RCM. Let's have a look at how that form was uh, created. Uh, it comes free as, as standard with GOSS RCM as a forms designer package. It's got a couple of fields on this form, uh, a text field for the event name. This whole area that's highlighted blue now is for the, the map picker. Just give myself a bit more space over here. And these are all the areas I can customise. The, uh, the label, um, some buttons I can change the text on. This example said hide map there, that's what comes over there. And the search button, the reset button, default location, there's a latitude and longitude, get some other options for the width, whether I want to be able to search data that's submitted, I want to expand the map, specify the height and width, the zoom level, where I want to start to start to zoom at, and the standard uh, map types that you'll be used to, and the search width, that's the box there specify how short or wide I want that to be and the default text that says enter address or postcode. Once I've made changes to that I can save this form and that will be published live to the website. I don't want to do that in this instance but I'm going to show you that data that I've just submitted. I've got a shortcut there all the data of submitted events. Here's all the uh, events that have been submitted recently and there's the one I just did, Circus click on it for some more information there's the latitude and longitude that I specified on the website and if I wanted to as an administrator I could perform other processes on this uh, perhaps uh, sending feedback back to the person that submitted it um, or uh, asking them for more information so it's a very quick overview of how the um, map functionality within forms works within GOSS ICM. Thanks for watching.